Good morning. Today in church, when we read the gospel, we hear a story about Jesus and some of his friends walking along a road together. And his friends, the disciples, they start to argue among one another about which one of them is the most important. And Jesus has to teach them a lesson. And so he takes a little child that was nearby and he sits him on his lap and says, if you want to be the great ones in the kingdom of heaven, then you need to be like this little child. And so today's story is called, Who is the Greatest? I am the best. No, I am the best. You are not. I am the best. The disciples were arguing as they walked along the road. They didn't know that Jesus had heard them arguing. Why are you arguing? Jesus asked them. What are you saying? The disciples' faces turned bright red. They were embarrassed, I think. They looked down at the ground, and no one said anything. The disciples knew that it was wrong to argue about being the best. So Jesus stopped, and he sat down, and he invited the disciples to sit down there with him. He lifted a little child up onto his lap. If you want to be the greatest, Jesus said, then serve and help everyone else. Jesus went on to say, this child believes in God and can serve others. It doesn't matter how big or how strong or how smart or how fast you are. Anyone can serve and help others if he or she tries, Jesus said. Then you are truly great. It's kind of different from what we hear in our daily lives, isn't it? We think that rich or smart or fast or strong or pretty, that those are the things that make us the greatest. But Jesus says no. He says the greatest are those who believe in God and serve one another. So this is just a question for you to think about. When is it that you want to feel important or that you want, to, want people to notice you? What are you doing in those times or... What is, it, what is it about you that you want people to see? And as you think about that, keep in mind what Jesus said. Believe in God and serve others. That's what makes you great. Thanks for being with me today. Bye.